Hello guys and welcome back to John Armstrong Rallying. Now, as you can see, I'm not in the UK, I'm not in Ireland. Um, today I am in Rovaniemi in uh, Finland. Uh, we're currently on a frozen lake and we are driving a Fiesta R2. Now it's a Fiesta 1.6 R2, the new respect one. I'm here with Matt Edwards today. Uh, Matt is the reigning British champion and he's been British champion twice um, but he also does driver tuition car setup and that sort of thing um, so Matt has tuition days out here in Finland and with me doing the Junior WRC so it's basically Junior WRC um, preview um, with me doing the Junior WRC and the first round being in Sweden I thought I need to get some practice on snow with studs so it's not ideal. I was actually supposed to do the Arctic Rally, which is in Rovaniemi, um, but that didn't go to plan. Uh, basically, I thought I had a full budget for Junior WRC, um, and then in the new year, things changed a little bit, <laughs> as they do in rallying, and uh, if something seems too good to be true, it usually is. Um, but I've got the budget to do the first two rounds, and big thanks to um, my sponsors that and backers that have uh, got me in the Junior WRC to do the first two rounds. The first two rounds is Sweden in a couple of weeks and um, then Sardinia is uh, quite a while away. You'll see the car is actually going out there now because um, I'm sharing with another person today. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cold here. It's about minus 10. Um, but yeah, back to the story. So basically today I'm paying for it myself so I just want to make sure I'm prepared to go and do the best job I can in Sweden um, which you may think I'm mad but I mean if you want to rally rally cars and not get paid just because you love it then you probably are mad um, should we get the car in shot yeah, let's just go on there, there. Um, so yeah, just want to make the most of it, so that's why we're here. Um, it's just one day. Currently driving on a frozen lake. Um, basically drive around with a big tractor and uh, dig out a track. Now, one thing I noticed is really hard to define the road and these snow banks here. Um, so I'm going to have to invest in some yellow glass tinted glasses to see better on the rally, I think. Um, but yeah. I mean, that's, that's why we're here. I've already learned a lot this morning. Um, Matt's been helping me with my technique, mainly braking and, and throttle inputs so far. Um, that's what we've been focusing on. Not, not so much car setup, just really just to get a feed for the studs and conditions so that uh, you know, I can go to the rally and not be uh, really rusty from the get go. Let's try and be a bit smoother now. Yep. <laughs> So after being at the frozen lake in the morning, we moved on to what was more like a proper rally stage. Yeah, it's like a rally spin track, but it, there's a, a proper like rally cross track on the inside of where we're currently driving, um, just to the left of where, we, where you can see now. Um, so I'd just been out with Matt around here with pace notes, and he was giving me some uh, pointers on, on how I could improve 
I had a good chat with Matt before I just went out for this run. It's actually my second run, taking Ashley out um, in the river seat as she was sharing with me today. And I was not driving particularly well the just before this run. Um, as you can see, I'm actually wearing yellow tinted glasses uh, as well, which made a big difference in defining the road between the banks. But yeah, it was like a huge difference between this I done two laps um, compared to the previous time I went out just getting a lot more cleaner getting max at speed um, and yeah towards the end of this run um, you'll hear my, my comments on it <laughs> how much better I felt it was but yeah it's a pretty good little track quite technical you're never really getting up um, to any sort of high speeds sort of third gear most of the way uh, as you can see now just coming around that this here's a rally cross track on your right so you don't actually use that just come around this corner we're just trying to be as neat as we can better yeah that was like 50 percent better yeah it felt just from better. what matt was telling me yeah i mean it, it's not the funnest way to drive but it's quickest yeah so a little bit about the junior wrc uh it's five rounds that take uh five rounds of the WRC that we compete in. Um, we've got Sweden, Sardinia, Finland, Germany, and GB. Um, so a good spread of events, but yeah, as I say, got the budget to do the first two, and my aim is to get good result, be in the championship hunt from them too. Um, Sweden's gonna be difficult, because um, the Scandinavians doing it, and they grew up in these sort of conditions like this, so. Um, yeah, it's going to be difficult, but if I could get a podium in Sweden, I'd be very happy. Um, yeah, it's hard I think we can go for a bit more of a push and try and get a win there and see where we are. But yeah, it's just one of them things. Um, like I said, not as uh, it's not as clear as what it was at the end of last year, but that's just the way rallying happens, and um, I'm in a position where I've. Uh, got a good uh, job and I mean it's not gonna pay for um, my full season that's for sure but it means I can pay for things like flights and uh, just little things here and there like this test today um, it means I'm, I'm just able to do things and I, yeah it's a bit scary using your own money to go rallying but I mean I've got the I've got backers that are willing to put money in so I have to take the risk and um, you know you only live once and I don't want to look back in 10 years and, and regret not um, taking a chance and, and starting the championship and seeing how we can do.
Then later on that evening slash night time, uh, we went to what they call uh, SS1 at Snow Rally Rings. And um, yeah, we were driving at night time with the lamp pod on. And you sort of get this tunnel vision. Uh, it's a lot more easier to define the road, which was good. Um, but it was quite tricky. The, there was a lot of snow on top of the surface, as you can see. Um, so if you go out of the, the sort of clean, rutted line, you lose a lot of um, traction. And can make it very tricky to get the front to go to where you want. Uh, I think this is my second time with Matt beside me. Um, Matt is calling pace notes, so that was good just to get uh, pace notes delivered to me in these conditions as well. Just had a big slide there. Um, but yeah, it's uh, a really, really good little stage, this bit of everything in it. Some technical sections where you need to wait on the car, and then more faster sections where you're you are obviously up to 4th, 5th gear and need to flow a lot more between whatever corners are coming up. But yeah, this was sort of the last, the last run that I've done. Um, also had, uh, <laughs> had Rory Bell in beside me call notes, which was funny. Um, but I don't think we're going to show it in this video, but... The thing about these conditions is it's very difficult to be consistently clean, is what I found. So you find like you'll do one one lap as such of the stage, and you'll do some corners perfectly, and then the next time you'll not do them perfectly, but you'll get some other corners perfect. So it's just just trying to work on that consistency. Yeah, really good experience. Um, it was well worth the trip. And I'll let you listen to the pace notes now. Continues over 150, keep in. Into two right. Bit of left foot on here. Yeah, yeah. 120 over dip. Break six right over crest. Opens long. And six left plus. 150. Oh, better, better, better. One left over brow. 100. Brow into two right. Slow 100. Four left minus. 60 over brow care. Six left. Early. Good. Better. 70. Brow when seen. Six left. 60. One right into hold. Three left into four right. Into early. Five left minus. 70 slowing. Left entry into sudden. Nine right plus. Sixty. That was actually quite nice. <laughs> Early four left. Into one right and one left. Into two right. Slow fifty. Right entry to five left minus. Into three right minus. Continues for one fifty. Into late sudden seven left plus. Tightens long. You did your throttle. You got it. I hit the throttle of it. Yeah. Three left. Titans to eight. Minus. And again. And right five continues over 100. Titans late. And you bitch. Into one left and one right. And three left long. Titans four plus. Into five right minus. And five left long tightens into seven right plus. Into six left opens long. Titans five continues for 150. 100. Two left continues over 100. Slowing late into six right plus. Three left minus continues over brow. 100. Titans five nips. Into right four opens long. 60. Five right long. Three left continues over 100. Titans five minus in. 62 right. Titans six plus. Bit too much yeah. lock to throttle sort of ratio. Good. That was a good break. Left five opens into crest. 70. Six right minus long. You feel that then, though, didn't you? Yeah. yeah, yeah 40. Yeah. Early. Six left loose. 
good. You carry the speed better just in pop, third. Yeah, Three right and long. Keep left over crest, only 59 left. Very long. And four right long. Keep it, let it work its way up. Four left times five. Continues over 100. 50 late, six left plus long. And three right. Into three left, continues over 150, keep in. A bit more left foot through there, neutralize it. Into two right, 120 over dip. Better, stop crest, six right. Feel it? Yeah. Opens long and six left plus. 150. Good, that's better, better, better. Feel the exit speed, yeah, 150 left on, over brow. On the throttle. Two right, slow 100, just do it a little bit earlier. Four left minus, 60 over brow, early six left. Good weight, well done, 70 brow, unseen six left. 60, one right, a bit more load in the middle, hold yeah. three left into four right. Into early, five left minus, slowing 70 left entry to sudden nine right plus. 60, early four left, good. Nice drive coming out. Yeah. One left and one right, two right, slow 50, right entry, five left minus. Into three right minus for 150. Titans late into sudden seven, left plus, Titans long. Good. Yeah, last corner is just in that. Yeah, it's, it's, it's almost a little handbrake, yeah. isn't it? Maybe in my notes, not, not, just not perfect on it either. Yeah. It's, it seems to tighten a bit. Cool. Good. You feel a little... I feel I'm driving a lot more efficiently. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I'm out of the slow stuff, I'm getting yeah, the throttle better. Yeah, just getting the drive. You're not getting the... You yeah. know, that first, was it the first lap? Or somewhere you we we noticed had a load of wheel spin, a load of lock on. It was a I come around my second lap and just then the start just the, the start. I was starting to go yeah. all full throttle and yeah, back to laying everywhere. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you can feel it, can't you? Yeah. yeah. So guys, just landed back in uh, the UK, back in England. Um, the weather is yeah, it's rainy as per usual. Um, not as not as nice in fin as it was in Finland. Um, but yeah, had a really good time in Finland, learnt lots with Matt, um, just improving my driving technique on snow and in general, just getting um, mainly my, my throttle and braking um, inputs a bit better and carrying just a higher gear and stuff like that. But yeah, it was a valuable experience to um, get out in the snow, still the tyres before Rally Sweden. Um, and I had a good time, uh, really cool place to go to, um, uh, up in the snow rally rings, really really cool facilities, it's like religion there, rally is, is religion and it's such a cool vibe, so definitely want to head back sometime, uh, but I hope you enjoyed this video, uh, do please subscribe and like it, um, and yes, obviously if you subscribe you're going to um, see all the stuff that I'm getting up to this year. I'm going to try and um, make as, as much content around the Junior WRC and some other things as well. But uh, yeah, really good trip. Um, I think the highlight was probably <sighs> so many different highlights to be fair. Just just the place in general. So much snow. I've never seen anything like that before. Um, just a winter wonderland. And uh, yeah, I've done the traditional finish um sauna last night um and yeah it was just an amazing trip so well worth it and really looking forward to rally sweden now um so yeah next stop rally sweden see you there